Now, talking about a new era, I saw a foreigner's announcement, just like you probably already have, that they are going out with Styx and John Waite next year. I mean, it's great. I think yippee for everybody because I personally love all of the bands, especially John Waite. Uh -uh. Wank, wank. He's such a cutie pie. But, you know, I'm scratching my head going, I read the announcement and I said to myself, um, I thought foreigner was done. I thought they were done done with the road. I thought it was over for them. I mean, come on. Mick isn't doing phenomenal on the health scale. And Kelly said on the Foreigner page, and I quote, the time has come. We have more or less lived our lives on the road for almost 18 years. We have always strived to give you our best and we intend to finish the same way. He goes on and ends by saying, I'm sure there may be occasions when we do some special appearances, but I think the time is coming for us to live off the road. Thank you so much. End quote. Now, Foreigner did 32 dates with Loverboy this year, and I didn't realize they did say that they would be touring through the end of 2024. So it is a lengthy goodbye for the band, but definitely spot on for their band choices for next year's leg and leg overlay it's overlay maybe it's over i don't who knows maybe they're coming back as avatars too mick jones did say at one point that he'd like to go out while the band is still at the top of its game but come on guys will mick be at all of these shows the ads look like he'll be there but will he really be there oh my gosh can you imagine if they put an avatar of mick jones at the shows that would be crazy it could happen though it really you know what why not put him as his 1977 self. Why not? He'd probably love it. Now, we don't hear much from Mick himself, just from the people who are around Mick and what they say about Mick and how Mick is. Now, when I spoke to Foreigner's Jeff Pilsen last year, he said that Mick was doing great. So we can only go on what we got. Now, I personally feel like Styx is never going away, ever, ever, ever. And John Waite is freaking amazing. His voice is so good. It's so, so good. Completely on point. And we have to just say and admit that Foreigner has done a great job keeping the band alive. Would I love to see Lou Graham be a part of Foreigner's last leg? Absolutely. And I'm sure that tons and tons and tons of his fans agree with me. Do I think it's going to happen? Probably not, but it would be kind of cool. Now, this upcoming tour is going to be called the Renegades and Jukebox Heroes Tour, and it kicks off on June 11th in Grand Rapids, Michigan at the Van Dell Arena. And as of right now, it will end on August 28th of 2024. That's going to happen at the Denny Sanford Center in Sioux Falls, South Dakota. Guys, will you be going to see Foreigner Sticks and John Waite? I think it's a great lineup. You know, why not? Just let us know. Are you going? Do you already have your tickets? Because they are on sale. So guys, have a great day, a great night, a great everything. I love you and I'll see you soon.